So I still have a bunch of printing to do. I have three more blocks to print. These ones are still drying. Yesterday I ended up... Go ahead. I ended up not printing yesterday. Can you just see her like random foot in the frame? Um, I didn't have enough paper to print my other blocks because they're all on uh, different paper than this. I need like bigger sheets and I have to tear them down. I'm gonna go get some paper and get that ready. I'm hoping to print some today. These aren't quite dry, so I don't wanna take them down. I might put more like drying lines. Uh, on this other wall of my studio. I don't know what I'm gonna do yet, but I have a lot more printing to do and not as much drying space as I had hoped. They're almost dry, so I am gonna go get paper now. Here's a side-by-side -side of the cabin prints. I thought it would look more bright in the ground than it does. You can see the main difference in this area. It's a bit brighter and it's subtle elsewhere in it as well. Like I think that area looks a little bit more cleaned up. Um, yeah, when they're side-by-side, -side, it doesn't look too different. Like this area looks a little more cleaned up there. I thought this whole area would look brighter, but I might go back in whenever I print this again and just lighten up all of this a lot more. Um, I thought I did, but it doesn't look that much different. I like it though. I like the subtle change. I switched out the type of paper I'm using, so I have to check the pressure again, and you can kind of see this embossment here. That might be a bit much, but you can kind of see, I think on the camera you can't quite see, there's like a little imprint of the 
ground down here. Um, yeah, you know, I'm pretty happy with this. Okay, this is a test print. You know, it actually looks pretty good. I might try to get it inked a little more. Still salty. This one I inked up a lot more um, and I'm pretty happy with this. I feel like the lines of the trees are really crisp, especially like this one, that one. Lightening up some areas really made this pop a lot more. Um, so seeing how a lot of these are so far looking a lot brighter as I carve away more. I'm kind of tempted to carve, I mean, I guess not be as shy with my carving in the future. Ooh, it's hard. I can hear my printmaking mentor from college be like, no, do test prints and then carve more, do test prints. And you know, what's it been? Almost seven years since, I, well, six years since I graduated. Uh, she's right. <laughs> she's so right. <laughs> oh man. Uh, shout out to Dibs. Thank you. Watch 
much more. Okay, and here is a side-by-side -side of the Echo Lake prints, which right away you can see that this lake looks brighter. This is the new one. I like that change a lot. The foreground also looks a little bit brighter, but otherwise the major change was these lakes back here. I didn't really change too much anywhere else. There's the old lake, the new lake. I think it stands out more. And it makes this uh, tree line here um, more defined. 